Well, hello everybody and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. Belba family has come out with some new books. <laughs> There's two new books, but I'm going to do two separate videos. Um, showing one in each video because they're very different from each other. This one we're a little kind of familiar with this format, but the other book is starting a total new series. And you may have seen them already on some other coloring channels, but not on mine. So in this video, we are going to look at square mandalas. This is called happiness. So this is the front of the book. Here is the back of the book with some images from inside and their standard 22 color palette that we're familiar with. And again, it is the square size because it is the mandalas and it is the three by three millimeter squares. The kind that I love so much. I was so excited to get these books. As you can see, I've, I've done a few out of here already. <laughs> so here is the nameplate page. And here it talks about this book. This is the third book in the Square Mandala series. We have Square Mandalas Book 1, Square Mandalas Animals and Patterns Book 2. And I love these. Matter of fact, I think I only have hmm, six or seven more to go in Book 2. <laughs> we have the color palette where you can match up your colors if you want. You can cut this out and keep it in with your pages. And then we get into the pictures themselves. So this is the first picture that I did. And I did this with the Statler Triplus pens. You'll see these all in my end of the month videos, but I don't mind showing them right now. Love how this one turned out. This one was with the Ink Onyx. Here's another one. And this I don't know if you can see the shine or not. I actually tried it with gel pens. This is with the Color It gel pens. I did have, because I haven't used my uh, gel pens in a long time, my Color It gel pens anyhow, um, I was having a problem once in a while, especially with the orange you can see here, with it coming out too fast, but it's not Color It gel pens fault. It is my fault because They've been sitting there a while, so but I thought it still turned out really pretty. So I matched up some colors um, with the color at gel pens, and I thought that turned out really pretty. And then here's another one with the gel pens, the glitter gel pens. Yeah, pretty. So yeah, works out really nice. So you can kind of see the designs in here. And like the name of the book is, it's happiness. So typically you have some, you know, pretty bright, happy colors in this book. Isn't that pretty? I can't wait till I get to that one. I always do these books in order. This one looks like it'll be fun too. So again, you can kind of see what they're going to look like. Not exactly. It's still going to kind of be a surprise. Kind of hard to do flip throughs of these. This kind of looks like a geometric type of design, and so. But yeah, these these look like great fun. You know me, I love my Belba books. So and especially the mandalas, any of these books, you know, with the three by three squares, I just because I always do my cross method, my cross stitch, I should say, the X method. So all types of pretty mandalas. I will link this book down in the description below as usual. Oh, that looks neat too. So just kind of a quick peek. Like I said, you can kind of make them out. That one's a little bit harder to see. But yeah, lots more fun. They keep coming out with all these awesome books. Here it talks about Belva Family, social media on Facebook and Instagram. Isn't that cute? 
And then we always have a couple blank sheets at the back if you want to match up your colors or try some coloring mediums in the book. So again, that is Square Mandala's Happiness. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this flip through of one of their newest books. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great day. And as always, happy coloring. Bye, guys.